On the evening of the 28th of July, the armed forces of the Russian Federation launched a precision-guided weapons strike on Ukrainian armed forces control point in Dnepropetrovsk. The assigned target has been neutralized. The goal of the attack has been reached. The Ukrainian armed forces continue at unsuccessful attempts at offensive actions in the South Donetsk, Krasny Liman and Donetsk directions. In the Donetsk direction, as a result of coordinated actions of the defending units in close cooperation with artillery of the U-Group of forces, five enemy attacks have been successfully repelled close to Belagorovka, Avdiivka, Pervomaiskoye and Krasnogorovka in Donetsk People's Republic. Ukrainian manpower and hardware have been hit close to Vesolye, Bogdanovka, Leshevka, Dileevka, and Novgorodskoye in Donetsk People's Republic. The enemy losses were up to 120 Ukrainian servicemen, three armored fighting vehicles, two motor vehicles, as well as one Mustabi Hautsa. In the south Donetsk and Zaporozhye directions, as a result of active actions by artillery of the Vostok group of forces, enemy manpower and hardware concentration areas have been hit close to Zolotaya Niva and Makarovka in Donetsk People's Republic, Novandreevka, Sherbaki and Kaminskoye in Zaporozhye region. The units of the 36th Combined Arms Army and their bomb troops successfully repelled two enemy attacks near Staromayorskoye and Urozhainoye in Donetsk People's Republic. During the fighting, the enemy lost up to 70 Ukrainian servicemen, one tank, one infantry fighting vehicle and two pickup trucks. In addition, one ammunition depot of the 44th Artillery Brigade has been destroyed near Marianovka in Zaporozhye region. The enemy losses were up to 135 Ukrainian servicemen, two tanks, three armored fighting vehicles, three motor vehicles, and one D-20 howitzer. In the Krasny Liman direction, as a result of the advance of assault detachments of the 42nd and 43rd mechanized brigades of the Ukrainian armed forces, which was revealed by the reconnaissance units of the center group of forces, the Ukrainian troops were preemptively hit. Two enemy attacks have been repelled near Raigorodka in Lugansk People's Republic and Serebryansky Forest. In addition, eight Ukrainian manpower and hardware concentration areas have been hit close to Novogorovka, Nevskoye and Chervone Adibrova in Lugansk People's Republic, Torskoye and Grigorovka in Donetsk People's Republic. The enemy losses were up to 170 Ukrainian servicemen, three armored fighting vehicles, two motor vehicles, one Akatsa self-propelled artillery system and one D-20 howitzer. In the Kupiansk direction, the assault detachments of the Zapad group of forces continued offensive operations close to Kuzemovka in Lugansk People's Republic and took more favorable positions. As a result of actions by Army Aviation and Artillery, Ukrainian units have been hit close to Simkovka, Timkovka, Berestavoye in Kharkov region and Stelmachovka in Lugansk People's Republic. The enemy losses were up to 20 Ukrainian servicemen, three motor vehicles and one D-20 howitzer. In addition, one ammunition depot of the Ukrainian 43rd Mechanized Brigade has been destroyed near Druzhelubovka in Kharkov region. In the Kherson direction, the enemy losses were up to 20 Ukrainian servicemen, two motor vehicles and one D-30 howitzer. Operational Tactical and Army Aviation, missile troops and artillery of the armed forces of the Russian Federation have neutralized 97 Ukrainian artillery units at their fire on positions, manpower and hardware in 103 areas. In addition, a fuel depot of the Ukrainian Zaporozhye grouping of troops has been destroyed close to Zaporozhye. One command post of the Ukrainian 47th Mechanized Brigade has been hit near Orehov in Zaporozhye region. Air defense facilities have intercepted two S-200 surface-to-air missiles, upgraded to attack ground targets, seven Storm Shadow cruise missiles, and two Heimer Simulrest projectiles. In addition, six Ukrainian unmanned aerial vehicles have been destroyed close to Verkhnikaminka in Lugansk People's Republic, Spornoye, Pervomaiskoye, and Marvinka in Donetsk People's Republic, as well as Marfopol in Zaporozhye region. In total, 457 airplanes, 244 helicopters, 5,314 unmanned aerial vehicles, 427 air defense missile systems, 11,021 tanks and other armored combat vehicles, 1,140 fighting vehicles equipped with MRLS, 5,652 field artillery cannons and motors, as well as 11,951 units of special military equipment have been destroyed during the special military operation.